All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're back at it at a Camaro. So it's really exciting. We're ready to start doing some more body work. Because unfortunately, last time when we took apart this uh, used quarter panel, we did a little bit of damage. So right here, when you unroll it, you definitely get a little bit of damage. Got a little bit of damage right here because all this was glued. Over here was glued, so not a big deal. A lot of body filler. Hopefully not a lot, but some body filler on this thing. We're going to, you know, sand it down, get it nice, get some primer on it. Also, I think the suspension should come in today. So we ordered a whole knee assembly and axle. So hopefully that comes in today. We can get that installed after we do the body work. Maybe check the alignment on it. And uh, we'll so go from there. Definitely a lot of work that we got to do today. So enough talking. Let's get straight to work. So there we have it. We got the car, we got the car with body filler on there. Looks really good. We got to sand it down, we got to scuff. We put etching primer on it. So we got the bare metal all ready to go. Also, we are ready to put some body filler on it. So we got this quarter panel all edged out. Got a little piece right here and all the way on top. So let's go ahead and mix up the primer 
put some primer down and see how it turns out. All right, so we're inside the paint booth. The next thing I want to do is get this door painted. We're pretty much going to trim it out and paint the whole door. So we'll see how it matches. If we have to do a blend, we'll do a blend. Also, we got the rocker molding that came in. So it's a different color. So we're going to have to paint it to match. So the next thing I want to do is wipe it down, wax and grease it, tack cloth, and then we're going to throw a sealer on this. Because it is a black car, we don't want nothing to shine through if any scratches do. So we'll go ahead and seal the whole door. Then we'll put about two to three coats of base on it and some clear. So let's get straight to it. Guys, the body work is getting knocked out. I was doing a great job on it. I mean, check it out. Primered up. We got a little black paint on there, so we know, you know, the dent stuff. So we let that dry. So while that's settling, we actually got our suspension part. So I got my axle here. Also the whole knee assembly. We got the spindle, control arms, just everything, the full nine yards. So let's go ahead and replace that. So then basically we'll be able to drive it off the frame. We could, you know, get it painted soon so we could drive it into the paint booth. It'd be a lot easier that way. So And we could check the alignment on it. Yeah, yeah, that'd be good too. So Obviously we still have a lot of damage over there, so we got the parts. Let's go ahead and just knock it out and get this thing run and drive again.
All right, all right, guys. Suspension work is done. That wheel is looking so much straighter. I don't know if you remember what it was before. It was completely just like, yeah. So now it's actually standing pretty straight, the camber wise, and the toe is also good, so it's pointing straight. There's some adjustment there, so we'll be able to adjust the camber toe later. But for now, it's looking good. Let's go ahead and worry about the paint job. So we'll drive into the paint booth, but check it out, it's messing out the front lights, and ooh, ooh, look at that. Nice. So it had those aftermarket lights in it already installed, I guess, into the headlights and into the grill. That's gonna look good. Pretty fancy. I think it does different colors and stuff. I don't know if I need a controller or something for this. I didn't see anything inside the car, but just do it. Flashing. There we go. Multicolored. I mean, the red looked good too, but that's nice to have different colors. That's pretty bright. Sweet. It's gonna look really good once I put the bumper back on. But, it's a little things. Let's keep going. All right guys, so I have painted the door and our side skirt and it looks great. I love the color, black, matching the rest of the car. We don't need to paint all the cars, so I'm really happy about it, but yeah, that looks great. These things are done. Let's go ahead and start working on the car, getting that prepped up for paint and get the car painted. We drive a Camaro in no time.
right, so there we have it. We got inside the paint booth. We got it all taped up. It's looking really good. What we want to do is put some sealer down because there's a lot of uh, different colors, different things. We want a nice, good, even coat. So let's put some sealer down on the quarter panel and the front lip. So let's get straight to it. All right, so there we go. We got two coats of clear on it. It turned out really nice, definitely happy about it. So now we're gonna leave this, let it dry before we assemble, but pretty much everything is painted. We're gonna really hope that it matches to the fender. If it doesn't, we'll blend the fender on, but definitely turned out really good. We'll see what's the next thing to do. And right, just like that guys, the Camaro is painted. Man, it's looking good. Wow, what a quick turnaround. Like you guys are saying, Ivan is fast and he is, he got it done. We're moving forward, we're getting it completed. But that's all the time we have for this episode, guys. Thanks so much for watching. We are gonna put this together and we're gonna get this Camaro on the road. So make sure you stay tuned. There's still a lot of work ahead of us. I still have a lot of pieces to put together. I'm gonna call Ed's Auto Glass, put that glass in there. Safety restore, we're gonna get those seatbelts back in there. Um, airbags, seats, interior, I got the whole curtain. I mean, yeah, there's so much to do, but no big deal. We'll get it done. Make sure you turn on the notification bell. Don't miss out, and we'll catch you next time.